Cole with a pass to Wilson along the boards. Cullen got run over there, just got buried along the boards, and he's still down, and he's on top of the puck. And he may be hurt. That is a nasty hit by Irwin. No arm went up, Jim, right away, but it's one of those plays where he was turning in to make a play. All kinds of action, though. Great penalty killing on a really effective power play, and one of the key factors in killing penalties is blocking shots. Watch that one on the heel, left heel of P.K. Subban as he's going down. And Pecorino getting challenged here, makes one save and then the quick response down low on the wraparound, just able to get some help there by Roman Yossi. And then watch this play. Cullen looking back the other way, gets hit right on the numbers and face into the glass. That's one that easily could have been called and should have been called you see he's about two feet from the boards there, and the puck was just going away. Getting some assistance as he skates to the bench. And Matt has a glance over at that Nashville bench before he heads down the hallway towards the dressing room. Jim, we've made lots of discussion points in game one, how difficult it is with the East playing the West. You don't have that built-in rivalry. The crowd is just watching it right now. And Mike Sullivan watching it on the big screen. He can't believe he didn't get a call there. And probably rightly so. They got the breaks in game one with the five on three. But this one has to be a penalty, doesn't it? Not according to O'Halloran and Pollock. 